As many of you know, director Simon West, who helms such films as Tomb Raider, The Mechanic, and Expendables 2, is currently busy <laughs> developing a remake to the 1958 horror classic The Blob, and according to reports, he's now found one of his lead performers. Samuel L. Jackson has joined the cast and will play a biochemistry professor attempting to thwart the otherworldly predator discovered deep within the earth that threatens the world. Mark Byersell, Samuel L. Jackson joining The Blob. It, it's a very <laughs> cautious buy here because The Blob is just one of the, you still hear The Blob and even though it came out long before any of us were born and any of our parents were born so in some cases, it still is that classic horror thing. It's like, oh, there's this blob that's coming towards us. We should see that on the big screen again. <laughs> now the casting of Samuel L. Jackson is of concern to me. I, he's a fantastic actor, but I, I want to see this being taken more seriously. I don't want it to be this silly over the common, uh, you know, I, I don't need to see Samuel L. Jackson saying, we need to get this mother effing blob of this <laughs> mother effing plane. What are you talking about? I'm walking out if he doesn't do that. I, I, I don't want to see that. I want to see it taken with some sort of uh, seriousness. I want it to be better than snakes on a plane. I don't want people just going in there just for a good hoot. I want it to be actually a scary, terrifying film. Christian? I'll cautiously buy it as well. And the reason I think I'm buying it is because of Kingsman. Because when I saw Sam Jackson cast in that role, I'm like, this is just basically the concerns Mark just had that you were worried about that, that it could turn into. And even though there was a bit, a bit of silliness, though, it worked in how Samuel Jackson portrayed his character in Kingsman. So not that this character is going to be the same, but it's just when he's... I'm worried it's going to be... I mean, because look what he did with Jurassic Park. Jurassic Park, it was, it was a long time ago. He wasn't Samuel L. Jackson yet, though, too. So it, it, it could either be that, or it could be Deep Blue Sea, or it could be Snakes on a Plane. There's so many versions of Samuel L. Jackson you can get. But it's Samuel Jackson, so I'm always excited to hear that he's going to be in a movie. But I'm with you, Mark. I just, it's just a matter of what version of not only him, but the tone of the movie. But I'm going to buy it because it's, it's Samuel Jackson, man. Um, I am going to buy it with the asterisk that it's what I'm hoping it's going to be. Yeah. I want this movie to be a horror movie. I want yeah. it to be a horror movie. And if it's a horror movie, I believe Samuel Jackson. Look, it's, it wasn't a great film, but 1408 was I thought he showed some things in that, that even though it wasn't a great movie. The John and, Cusack? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. That I thought he, the way he lifted the film with those elements, right? When he wants to play it that way and not be the, you know, not be his character from Pulp Fiction, then he can be really effective. And if that's the way they're going, I'm going to be really happy. If they go a little bit slapstick and look, this is coming from the director who did The Mechanic, Expendables 2, and Tomb Raider. It is, there is a good likelihood then that this is going to be a little more silly action, probably get this mother effing blob off yeah. my mother effing planet. I, I don't know that line. I hope it's not, yeah. but I'm going to be open minded to the but I'm going to believe in all my naivete that it's going to be a horror film. He's going to play this deep and dark. And if it is, I think it's going to work. But so I'm going to give it a buy. I'll tell you what, though. If they do go in that direction, because you're right, because that's Simon West, it most likely will be the action kind of some comedy involved as well, too. But if it's fun, if it's fun, then yeah. I'm okay with it. If it's not, yeah, just, I, I don't want Piranha 3 Double D where they're right. trying to be no, fun. No, no, like a B, a B like movie. Over B of, movie. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, no, but if it's fun, if you walk out going, you know what, it was silly and ridiculous, but I had a good time with it, then I'd be okay with it. Lots of different ways this film can go.